Brass, brass, brass. Oh, boop. Kapaya. Do say poof. Can I help you? Here's the thing about wishes. Who is she? Who's the girl? Can you make me a prince? This is a big hat. No, that is. Aladdin, who steals to make ends meet with the help of his pet monkey, Abu, one day while wandering the streets, comes across a gorgeous girl. She gets in trouble for not paying for bread she gives to youngsters. Aladdin rushes to her aid, and the two are pursued by the royal guards. After evading their pursuers for a bit, Aladdin invites the girl to his home for tea. The girl's name is Dahlia, and she is the princess of Agrabah's handmaiden. She is forced to flee as another suitor for the princess, Prince Anders, arrives. Princess Jasmine's name is Dahlia, and Dahlia is her handmaid and dearest friend. Meanwhile, Jaffer, the Sultan's loyal advisor, is preparing to depose the Sultan by obtaining the magic lamp. However, the lamp is buried in the magical cave of wonders, and only the diamond in the rough can enter, which he is not. Consequently, he spends weeks searching for this diamond in the rough. After rejecting Prince Anders' marriage proposal, Jasmine receives an unexpected visit from Aladdin, who has come to return her mother's stolen jewelry, which Abu took. He leaves her with a promise to meet again but is apprehended by the royal guards. The following day, Aladdin wakes up in the desert alongside Jaffer, who believes he is the diamond in the rough. Jaffer informs Aladdin that the girl he encountered was the princess and offers to make him rich enough to impress her if he helps him retrieve the lamp. They arrive at the cave in the evening, and due to Aladdin being the diamond in the rough, he is granted secure entry. The Cave of Wonders is filled with magnificent riches that tempt both Aladdin and Abu. However, they have been warned to only retrieve the lamp and resist the allure of the wealth, as getting caught up in it would trap them inside the cave forever. During their journey, they encounter a magic carpet and eventually find the lamp. Unfortunately, Abu is enticed by a large, sparkling ruby and takes it, angering the spirit of the cave. As a result, the cave starts to collapse. Aladdin and Abu manage to make their way back with the help of carpet, but they get trapped inside the cave when Jaffer steals the lamp and betrays Aladdin. While trapped inside the cave, Abu confesses that he took the lamp from Jaffer. Aladdin, realizing the potential of the lamp, discovers that it is dirty and proceeds to rub it. As he holds the lamp, a powerful genie is released, who promises to grant him three wishes. Aladdin's immediate wish is to escape the cave, but he does so without using one of his wishes, preserving them for later. Aladdin, along with genie, Abu, and Carpet, finds themselves in the middle of the desert. Aladdin realizes that with genie's abilities, he can fulfill his desire to be with Princess Jasmine by becoming a prince. Genie transforms him into Prince Ali, and they make a grand entrance as they parade to the Sultan's palace, where the Sultan warmly welcomes them. Aladdin feels embarrassed as he tries to impress Jasmine as Prince Ali, especially when Genie coerces him into performing a dazzling dance in front of the princess. However, instead of being impressed, Jasmine simply walks away, unimpressed by the spectacle. Meanwhile, Jaffer starts to develop suspicions about Prince Ali's true identity. Later, Aladdin leaves and Jasmine retreats to her chamber, while Genie takes Dahlia for a late-night stroll. Aladdin, being true to himself, takes Jasmine on a magical carpet ride, and during their journey, they grow closer to each other. From their vantage point high above, Jasmine recognizes that Ali is, in fact, Aladdin. However, Aladdin convinces her that he disguised himself as a commoner to escape the pressures of royal life. After the carpet ride, Aladdin escorts Jasmine back to the castle, where they share their first kiss, savoring the moment of their blossoming romance. The next day, however, Jaffer catches Aladdin, who has discovered his true identity. He threatens to throw him in jail until he informs him where the light is. When Aladdin rejects everything, Jaffer throws him from his tower and into the sea. 
Aladdin manages to rub the lamp before drowning, after which Abu and Carpet come with it. Genie saves Aladdin, and they confront the Sultan about Jaffer's betrayal after conversing with Jasmine. Jaffer tries to mesmerize the Sultan into believing they are lying, but Aladdin crushes his staff, revealing Jaffer's treachery to the monarch. Jaffer is imprisoned but escapes after his parrot companion, Iago, gives him the keys. Meanwhile, the Sultan expresses his gratitude to Aladdin for exposing Jaffer's deceit and expresses his desire to have Aladdin marry his daughter. As a result, Aladdin decides not to use his final wish to free Genie, believing that he cannot maintain his prince persona without him. Genie is disheartened by Aladdin's choice to continue living a lie and retreats into his lamp. Deep in thought, Aladdin returns to his former home and comes to realize that Genie was right. He realizes that he must disclose the truth to Jasmine. Just then, he notices that the light has disappeared and is now in Jaffer's possession. Jaffer harbors ambitions of becoming the Sultan, but when the guards refuse to obey his commands, he uses his second wish to transform into a powerful sorcerer. He banishes Aladdin to a remote and distant location, and he puts Jasmine in a perilous situation by threatening to harm Dahlia and the Sultan unless she agrees to marry him. In the meantime, Genie takes action and dispatches the magic carpet to search for Aladdin and Abu. As the wedding ceremony continues, Jasmine spots Aladdin walking down the aisle. She participates in the wedding, and when she comes near enough to Jaffer, she steals the light from him and leaps onto the carpet. Jaffer sends Iago after them, transforming him into a massive parrot. During the chase, they almost lose the lantern, but they manage to recover it. However, Iago snatches it back, only to lose it when the Sultan interrupts Jaffer's wizardry on him. Iago transforms back into a normal parrot. Meanwhile, Jaffer creates a sand twister that captures Aladdin and Jasmine and brings them back to him. Jaffer now has them at his mercy, proclaiming himself to be the most powerful man on the planet. However, Aladdin responds by asserting that Jaffer is not as strong as he believes. The genie remains the most powerful entity in the universe since he both gave Jaffer his power and can take it away. Realizing the truth in Aladdin's words and that he is still the second best genie, Jaffer uses his final wish to become an all powerful genie. The genie, after recognizing Aladdin's clever plot, fulfills his request and transforms Jaffer into a monstrously strong genie. Jaffer declares himself the ruler of the universe, wielding incredible cosmic power. However, Aladdin's earlier point about the price of genie power still holds true. Jaffer finds himself encumbered by his own golden shackles and trapped within a lamp prison, along with Iago, as they both get sucked into it. Jaffer's spell over Agrabah is undone, a result of his own greed. Genie takes Jaffer's lamp and sends it soaring to the Cave of Wonders, where Jaffer and Iago are condemned to live as prisoners for many years. Aladdin expresses his apologies to Jasmine and the Sultan for his deception and prepares to leave. Just as he's about to depart, Genie informs him that he still has one wish remaining, allowing him to become a prince again or overturn the decree that forbids a prince from marrying a princess. However, Aladdin selflessly chooses to grant Genie his final request instead. Genie decides to use his newfound freedom to travel the world with his girlfriend, Dahlia, and start a family with her. The Sultan has chosen to abdicate his throne and make Jasmine the Sultan of Agrabah. Meanwhile, Aladdin slips away unseen, convinced that he is not suitable for Jasmine. She eventually catches up with him, and the two hug and eventually get married. 